everyone, Sadali here. Today I want to finish up with 10 things to take the trauma out of home buying. First, you want to remember that your home doesn't exist in a vacuum. Don't get caught up on the physical aspects in terms of room size, kitchens, etc. You really want to take everything into consideration. Don't forget the noise level outside, your commute to friends and family, and to work. Those are very important aspects of the home. Tip number two, don't wait until you make an offer to get pre-approved. You want to do your due diligence and investigate mortgages, home insurance, scheduling. Because ultimately, my job is to present your offer, and to present an offer that has many unresolved contingencies will always make it look weaker to the seller in terms of making a decision. You want to factor in maintenance post buying a home. Even if it's a new home, you're always going to have to take care of that property. And the last thing you want to do is not have a budget to stop deterioration in the future. You want to always accept that there's going to be a little bit of buyer's remorse. It's inevitable. This is a huge commitment for you, especially if it's a first-time home. But ultimately, you want to really think about the benefits you're going to yield in the future. And lastly, and I believe most importantly, you want to choose a home that you love. Don't think about appreciation in the future. Although homes between 1998 and 2002 appreciated on an average of 5.4%, you really want to think of the home and what it's going to offer you in terms of comfort, lifestyle, and safety for you and your family. So if you have any thoughts about making a purchase or you have questions about buying a home, any concerns or questions about this video, feel free to reach out to me. My email is Sidalia, C-I-D-A-L-I-A, at kw.com. I look forward to hearing from you and make it a great day.